All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome into the stream. A uh, couple things. First of all, uh, we've got some storms coming through here, so if I end up suddenly disappearing, that's why. So the storms may create a short stream. You never know. Uh, and also, um, as you see on the uh, right-hand side, right over there, spectators' comments are not displayed because you have entered a block scene. Uh, this whole game is like that. So it will never show me any comments that you guys make on the right-hand side of the screen. The only comments I will see is when I happen to look over into chat. It will still show up in the chat room, but comments do not dis get displayed on the little side scroll off to the side there. So if it takes me a couple of minutes to respond to anyone saying something, that's why. All right. Let's jump back into Until Dawn. was weird let's Super try this again there we go all my pals back to the annual Blackwood winter getaway I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters I need to go find Sam son of a bitch so I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? It feels the same to me. Hey, look, it's Freddie Mercury, guys. Who would have known that, like, a future Oscar winner would be in this kind of little bit of a uh, horror video game? It feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, oh, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it's so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, 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 we get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own a place, right? Hey. Hey there, mama. Where are you? Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Welcome into the stream. How are you doing today, hon? from being kind of cold and vaguely creeped out by this place. It's, it's kind of weird being back up here, huh? Yeah. I'm doing all right. Okay, so this Chris guy, this guy right here, the one that I'm controlling, he's one of two characters I absolutely cannot stand. And I will not be disappointed if I cannot save him again this round. The last time I played this game, he was one of the people I could not save, and I did not care. 
And when she shows up, I'll point out the other one I absolutely cannot stand. What, anything over here? No, nothing over here to look at. All right. All right, come on, Freddie Mercury, let's go. Tell us how you really feel. I thought I just did. Okay, I can't go this way. Can I go this way at all? Oh, I can. Let, let's talk to let's talk to Matt here. Matt, been a while. Rough season, huh? Yeah, something like that. Hey, you okay, man? Some people, you know. You think you know them? Okay. And then there's something on the ground over here. Well, check that out in a minute. Let's see what else we got over here. Well, let's talk to... Who is that the other person I can't stand? No, that's uh, what's her, that's Hayden Panettiere. Let's talk to her for a minute. Oh. Is he an ash yet? Um, yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. How's, uh... What's she doing? She's fine. Why? No worries, it? Okay, that was weird. I don't think I've ever been down here in all my playthroughs of this game. I don't th I've never come down this way. And talk to, like, these other guys. Alright, well, let's pick up the totem over here. Let's see what it's going to tell us about. What is this game about? It's a, uh, a single-player survival horror game. I think it's a PlayStation exclusive, though, Mama. Oh, hold on, hold on. What's this? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know. Now I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Now yeah, this could be kind of a dick. Uh, absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like, that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Uh, yeah, let's agree with him. Be a, kind of a dick. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. And as I like to point out, the guy who so I'm not controlling that I'm walking with, Josh, that's a future Oscar winner who played Frederick Mercury. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh shoot, nobody likes cool buns. Okay. Gotta keep looking around for like little clues and shit. Not that. Damn, I'm getting pretty low on juice here. I just gotta turn off my GPS. Let's see if can we go up here? I'm finally like outside where I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone talk? What? Why? No. Nope. That's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, I can do all this stuff. And... Well, you got an app that can get us into the lodge. Oh, let's so grab the axe. Got an app that can get you laid. Well, actually, dude, there's this... you don't. The answer is that you don't. Oh, yeah, that's not at all weird. Whatever you do, don't mention it to your buddy right there. We got ourselves a thinker. Nice one.
Hey there, Bethy. How are you doing today, hon? Uh, in case you guys haven't noticed, comments do not come up on the little side scroll off to the side right there, so it takes a while for me to kind of see them and respond to them. I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here. Use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the Lormy dudes. Yep, ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and push. Bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm going to go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. <clears throat> I, I kind of wish I could kill this guy like right now, but whatever. I can, I really do not like this guy, for no particular reason other than he just bugs the crap out of me. Something about him just bugs me. Okay, so we got something going over here, let's check this out. That's another totem thing, that's right. I gotta keep looking for like little more clues and shit. I don't think there's anything really over here though. Anything over? Oh no, is there something there? No. Can't go over that way. Uh, okay, you can go in here. Oh, there's that. What's that? Ex-janitor convicted for arson. Swears revenge on movie mogul's family. I'm sure that has no bearing on the plot whatsoever. Okay, I think this room is pretty much done. Alright, let's walk out of here. Let's go this way. We won't leave this room quite yet. Well, I wanted to look around for any more clues. I think that's about it. Yep, that's the totem I saw earlier. Alright, yep, okay, this room is done. Is there anything over here? Nope. And this looks like a dead end. Yeah. Hold on, before we go in there, there's something else this way. Nope, there isn't. Alright. Very funny. 
Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. Yeah, yeah, yes, I'm totally on it. I'm totally not just trying to look for clues and shit and maybe get this guy killed in the meantime. Okay, we came from. We, yeah, we came from this way, right? Yeah, we did. All right. Go back. We need to go out this way. I think. Yeah. No TV. Aw, oh, man. I wanted to watch some Netflix. Okay, can I go back here at all? No. Furniture is pushed too close together. Oh, no, I can. Is there anything back here at all? No. Oh, let's check out the dining room really quick. Oh, there's something glowing over here. Let's, um, I guess we're gonna, wait, 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 wait. This lighter is lasting like forever. Uh oh, kind of caught in here, I think. Oh, wait, I can just go this way, I think. Yeah. Let's go downstairs. If the game will let us. Nothing really over here. Oh, okay, let's check out this door first. Ah, oh, it's locked, of course it is. All right, how about this one right here? Another picture?
Okay, that's just nothing. There's a door here. I oh, can't get to it though. Okay, I think this is a dead. All right, let's go upstairs. And then let's go even more upstairs. That lighter is immortal. Yes, it is. Oh, sure. Just leave that window open. That's totally cool. You're only in the middle, up in the mountains in the middle of a snowstorm. Anything back here? No. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is that... No, that's nothing. All right. Got to keep looking for like little glowing shit. And let me guess, this is probably a dead end. Yeah. All right. Well, let's cut over this way. Let's go ahead, go on in here. There we go. Uh, this game has a lot of jump scares, by the way. Like a shitload of jump scares. Ah, perfect. Hey, wait a minute. I wasn't done exploring. We're freezing our buns off out here. <clears throat> Apparently the game thinks I was done exploring. It's like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire to go. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Uh, let's challenge. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. With the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Uh, yeah, that, the other guy, not this guy, but the other guy, you'll know him uh, from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. if you ever watch that. Right. Yeah. Duh. Sorry, it's been kind of a long day. I overreacted. Nah, man. Don't worry about it. Is it cool? Yeah, yeah, totally.
This is the other person I can't stand. Fucking Emily. Are you trying to swallow his face hole? I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's better. She didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Em, come on. No, shut up, Matt. Stay out of it, you dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, you're the only one who can put him down? No one else can play with your toys? You're such a bitch. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. Honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. And there's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for ten minutes, then maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. You wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. It, it's right up the trail. <sighs> well, that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, can we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos? Yes, Mama, very much so. Drooling all over that girl at the counter. Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. Then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. And here we go, already splitting everyone up. Just like a very, very common horror movie. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Yep, yeah, another one splitting up. Romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! Gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourself. Mm hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. I almost forgot. You gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You wanna invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. <clears throat> okay, so yeah, this, this game has uh, three people who... You might know from somewhere else or who were known at the time. Hayden Panettiere at the time this game came out. Hayden Panettiere was obviously the big name of the, of the bunch because of, you know, Heroes and, and Hayden just her being you know, known from other stuff. Um, this guy right here, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I think he started Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. like right after this game came out or right before this game came out. One of the two. Then, of course, uh, the dude who played Josh, he uh, would go on to win an Oscar for his performance as Freddie Mercury in Bohemian Rhapsody. Um, everyone else I kind of know from a couple other places, uh, there's a, the girl who plays Emily and the girl who plays Ashley. Both of them had very small parts on, uh, 
uh, the Shameless TV series. Ashley was in like one episode. Um, and Emily, she was in a few different episodes. Um, no one else I really know from this game, though. No, no, I take that back. The uh, you'll see an analyst appear sometimes in between scenes. He's a very, very well-known character actor. Uh, I know him primarily from um, the show Prison Break. But I know he's done a shitload of other stuff, too. He's one of those guys that you know him when you've seen him. Yeah, you recognize a couple. Yeah, this is uh, this is done, you know, obviously with uh, people who either were known or were close to being well-known. Okay, we got to watch for clues. Just got to keep kind of walking around looking. Got to cut over this way. Love Prison Break. You'll you'll know the analyst when you see him. I cannot ref for the life of me remember his character's name, but you'll know him when you see him. Oh no, Danger Totem. All right, let's get in here. Let's fire up the gen. Just like in Dead by Daylight, we got to repair the fucking generator. All right. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Woo! You are a wizard. Oh uh, yeah, the generator repair was a lot easier. I just can't seem to get away from repairing gems, even when I play a different game. Alright, let's head on out this way. There it is. the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Well, whoever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Oh, this little cabin. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. We will find another way around. 
This cabin they're going to is like 20 fucking miles away. Yeah, just a minute. Let me let me look for shit first. I want to find clues. I want to be like Fred and Scooby Doo and find fucking clues. Uh, nope, it won't let me look back over here. All right. <laughs> well, yeah, seven limbs. Don't you have seven limbs? Okay, we need clues. We need clues, Daphne. Uh, I'm not really seeing anything over here. Two arms, two legs, and one head. And fingers, oh, sometimes. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? Hold on, let's see what's down here. We'll save it for the cabin buster. Maybe when you do math, that's not seven, but when I do math, that's seven. <clears throat> Alright, let's come back over this way. Oh, we got. Oh, I was about to say something. We got this way and this way, but. No, I want to find more shit. Oh, I want to look this way first. Oh, yeah, I saw that thing back there. Let me look at this thing first, though. Whoa. This place is, like, historical. Holy bat cave. It's got to be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Rubber. Oh, it looks like I should be able to go that way, but I can't. That sucks.
All right, come on, Jessica. In the tight pants. Pug butt. Look at that. She kind of got a pug butt. Look at that. Right. Uh, no, stop, stop, stop. I uh, can't get. I had it resting on her butt for a minute. Anything over here? What's over here? Looks like it's gonna hurt. Look how far away this frickin' cabin is that they're going to. It's taking them forever to get there. Wait, what's this? I don't remember this. I, oh, I can't even look at it. Uh, it's so far away from the main house that it can't even be called a guest cabin. It can, all it can be called is just like a remote cabin or something. Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? <sighs> Take a ride on Air Force One? <laughs> alright, alright. Save for the dumb beach buddy. Ooh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Um, whoa. You alright? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. Let's see. Hey Jess? Mm-hmm. Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Yeah, what? In the snow in the mountains, you think? Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please! Come on! Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> I mean, God, you go, gotta go through like two fucking different gates just to get to this damn cabin. Yeah, she got a pug butt. Look at that. Oh, she turned around. She knew I was looking at her butt. Oh, there's jump scare. What, number three or four? Maybe five? Mama, any says anything to get laid? Yeah, pretty much. Debbie Downer. 
Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You got something on your face. Ah. Go! Okay. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! This tub is fucking enormous. Look at the size of this damn tub. It's like a five-person bathtub. I don't remember ever coming up here. Oh, I don't think I've ever been up here. Maybe I have, but I don't remember. It's been quite a while since I played this game. I don't think I've ever been up there. That was new territory for me, I'm pretty sure. Hmm, okay, this looks to be 100% a dead end. Okay. Yeah, let's just, let's go snooping around in other people's rooms. Why not?
Hmm. Okay, I guess I have to go there. I thought there was stairs going down out of here, but I guess not. All right, let's go see what those guys are up to. Well, let's explore around up here for a minute first, really quick. Well, hold on, hold on. Is there... Can I go this way at all? I can. Is there anything over here? Me? Oh, there is. Oh, that looks like I might be able to pick it up. I guess not. All right, let's open up this door. Just go snooping through all the rooms before we go down and talk to them. Or not. Is there anything over here? Oh, come on, I want to hear Freddie Mercury's idea for those two. Okay, I think we're pretty much done exploring up here. I think we're going to have to go down and talk to those guys. Hold on, let's, I want to explore it down here first, Freddy. Can we turn on the TV yet? Nope. No Netflix and chill. Uh, I don't think there's anything in here. At least nothing that I haven't already seen. All right, let's go with Freddie Mercury. I mean, aesthetically speaking, I like the design of this house, just the overall layout of the house, I really like. Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. <laughs> they are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over. You know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> Uh, I've already looked at that. Anything else I can look at over here? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Let's follow Freddy. Let's see where he's gonna go. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh. I just wanted to say. What? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year, and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. 
Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Oh, why do you have so many locked doors in this place, Freddy? Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality. Right, Sam? I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you, can you hold this? What's that? Hold as well. Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see? I didn't even there? fucking move. Nice one. Okay, first things first, we gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Hey Joker, right. how are you doing today? Five, oh, I missed doing him, giving him a high five. Josh. 
Uh, hello again, Joker. <laughs> Probably just like not anything. Uh, why don't you hold down the floor while I make sure? Whatever you say, man. Oh, okay, no problem. No problem, Joker. Oh wait, I want to go back to this. I want to see. Can I go back this way at all? Sort of. I want. I want to look for clues and shit. Nothing back here. Uh, can I go back this way? Like, how far will it let me walk away from this? <laughs> Damn, it's letting me go all the way back here. Fucking hell. Oh, I know there's really nothing up that way. Let's... Let's go ahead and see what that noise is. Come on, Hayden Panettiere, smack him in the face what with the, the flashlight. Why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. Yeah, are you doing okay, Mama? I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally missed your Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true call. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. to understand your feeling toward people who fear failure and worry about what others think of them. Do you share this fear? Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you're playing your game. Now is it?
investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What do you value? What do you respect in yourself and others? Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Well, wait a minute. If they're going to be loyal to you, they'll be honest. Hmm. So you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend? Okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? <laughs> so you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? Yep, there he is, Mama. Oh, well, again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Yep, uh, yeah, he, I knew he was a mob boss, but I could not think of his name. Alright. Uh, would anyone like to play some Dead by Daylight? Okay, I'm going to go ahead. Let's uh, take a break from uh, Until Dawn. Let's uh, switch over to play some Dead by Daylight. If anyone would like to join me, they are more than welcome to. Uh, that was, I will have to interrupt the stream briefly while I switch games, but if you guys want to hang out in the chat room, I will be back very shortly. It won't take but a few minutes. <laughs> 